Hi guys, so what have I been up to? Um, recently I've been getting some stuff, well I say getting stuff, I've got something I've had before a few times and that's a bloody horrible nasty shitty cold which I am just getting over now which is why I'm doing this video now and I hadn't done a video for a little while because I've been coughing and spluttering everywhere. So sorry for the fact I haven't done one recently um, but I'm getting over that now hopefully. <laughs> I have also been out and about a little bit. I did go up to Lakeside with the kids and went to the Nickelodeon Adventure, sort of Nickelodeon World. Um, it's not bad, actually. It's quite good. It's a long way to go. The kids enjoyed it a lot. I think for adults, it's, it's all on one floor, so you think, hmm, it's a bit naff. But actually, it's quite clever the way they've done it, and the kids loved it, so that's worth doing. As with all things, I shall put a link to that down below. Um, it was a bit strange trying to explain to the kids who Ren and Stimpy were and what Ren and Stimpy meant. Um, but it's way, way, way before their time, way before most people's time, to be honest with you. And even if it wasn't before their time, it's probably a bit adult and a bit under, you know, what's all this about. But I love it. Also, as I said in the last video, I have got a new filter for the drone at last. So that new filter arrived in a rather strange little box. It's a little, I say box, it's a little sort of cylinder container thing. Um, it's a two part filter, there's two parts in there. Obviously, they're not in there anymore because it's now on the drone. What I mean by two parts is that you've got the filter on the actual front of the drone. So that's the new filter, it's a UV filter. That actually pops off, so it's connected to like a little connector ring and then you can actually take it off. So should you need to fly without it, now it is only a UV filter, so to be honest with you, it doesn't darken the image in any way, so I don't think you'd ever want to take it off, but should you want to, you can do. <coughs> One of the issues with it, like with a lot of things, is once you put it on your drone, it makes the cover a little bit harder to get on to put it away. But never mind, eh? it still works. So I've done a couple of things with that. One of the things was to do a bit to carry on with the forest stuff and the idea of the deforestation. I went over a field full of solar panels. I'm sort of wondering, are they replacing forests with renewable energies? What would you rather have? Electricity to charge your phone only lasts for 14 hours a day or air to breathe? Hmm, not so sure about that one. So I'm also carrying on with my theme or my sort of colour of the year theme. Colour of the year has sort of become a bit more obviously, so it's come colour of the decade with my sort of iridescent colours and I've actually stuck some on the headlights of the car, like you do. Um, simply because I mean, the headlights of my car have got cracks in that sort of let water in a bit occasionally anyway, so I thought I'll cover them up with something, make it look a bit different. I'm now driving along with sort of a greeny, pinky colour, <laughs> which is actually quite nice, I quite like that. So that's continuing on. Carrying on with that from the car, there's also a car show this weekend, this Saturday, it's the Halloween one. Do it every year. I didn't go to the last one beginning of the month because I couldn't be bothered because it was too close to the other one. So this one's the end of the month, Halloween, they always do a good show. It's brilliant to see the way that people do their cars up and they really go in for it. I have got behind me over there some Halloween heads or skulls lights. I will take those, put those in the car. I've got another light somewhere to put in the car somewhere. I'll take those. Obviously, I'm going to dress up now. I've got to dress up for work anyway, or I'd like to. Last year, I did the Beetlejuice outfit. Beetlejuice outfit's up there, hidden away. I'm not going to wear the Beetlejuice outfit again. I'm not going to wear it two years on the trot. So I've got a different outfit this year. I'm not going to do as much makeup. I'm going to do a little bit. I'm being a little bit inspired, or tried to be a bit inspired this time, by the new Ed Sheeran video. I don't normally like Ed Sheeran very much, but... This sort of Ed Sheeran's Bad Habits, I actually quite like the song, so. Quite like the video, so I'm inspired by that. So I'll be wearing that to work and spending the day at work like it, and then carrying on in the evening when I go to the car show, I'll be like it again in the car show, so that'll be quite nice to do.